Welcome back. I am going through all of the comments from that recent video I made saying ask me anything about hair loss. Ultimately, so I could prove a point, I've made a video addressing any comment anyone could possibly seriously leave me about hair loss. All you have to do is go into the search box on YouTube and type in my name, Nick Shell, along with your question, and multiple videos will pop up. For some reason, people continue to ask me questions on things I've already mentioned and covered videos on. And if nothing else, let's do a fresh version, a 2020 coronavirus lockdown version of these videos I've already made probably at least half a dozen times. Here's another one. Again, any question you have about hair loss, just go to YouTube, search box, Nick Shell, type in your question there. Multiple videos will, will pop up. But hey, uh, let's just go ahead and do a fresh version. Daniel Fernandez, quote, I'm 17 and I experienced thinning around my temples and it has definitely been a depressing process and it only started a month ago. I may be overthinking it, you are, and I assess it to be a Norwood one or two from your videos. I've always had a widow's peak, not a problem, but in the past month it's just bad and I'm lost on YouTube searching for videos for an explanation. I would really like to submit pictures so you can have out, no way, I will not do that. I do not accept pictures from teenagers. I am old enough to be your dad and that's weird and creepy. I want to fix this problem in my teen years so that it doesn't get worse as time goes on. Uh, so here's my response to this. And, and I love what Coca Kukla had to say. And this is ongoing uh, suggestion to anyone where uh, he said, check out the five ways. It, it, I made a video called uh, the Will I Go Bald Test. It's a video on here. It's one of the most important videos I've made about hair loss it tells you ways to actually help predict this. But specifically, what, what we need to address in your comment here, the temples thinning. And you, yeah, you probably are overanalyzing this as far as what Norwood you are. What I need you to do, I need you to go on YouTube, type in Nick Shell, type in, I think it's 1998, getting a perm. I think that's the video. There's a video from VHS of in 1998, I was 17, and I'm getting a perm. That's kind of a joke for my yearbook pictures for senior year. And towards the end of the video, it zooms in on my temples. My sister had a VHS recorder. She was filming it. You can clearly see at age 17, I was over 17 at the time, but not quite 17 and a half, my temples had receded and they were thinning. That was in 1998. Here we are in 2020. That was when I was 17. Now I am 39. So how many years have passed? 22 years have passed. And this is what I've got left. And no, I haven't had a hair transplant. No, I don't take prescription drugs. I'm not doing anything to make this happen. This is my hair. And so I continue to tell everybody, receding temples, who cares? Norwood one, who cares? Now we could, in theory, say that receding temples is Norwood one. I'm just not worried about Norwood 1. Norwood 1 is not a sign of balding. Norwood 2 is not even a sign of balding. It's not until we get past Norwood 2.5, because I'm 2.5 now with something on top, but no one is really sincerely going to look at me as a balding guy. It's not until Norwood 3 with thinning that we're really talking about balding. So I'm telling you, based on what you've told me right now about yourself, age 17, receding temples, Here's what I'm gonna to respond to you. I'm gonna say, look at your future. I mean, I could be wrong. Things could go differently for you, but I was in your shoes in 1998. The summer of 98, I was 17. You can watch the video, search for it. Again, keywords would be 1998, receding temples, Nick Shell gets a perm, type that in. Just search, search for it, watch it. You'll be amazed at how my temples had undeniably receded and thinned, and yet here I am now at age 39. So that's what I'm going to tell you. I don't see any reason you have to worry. But yes, in addition to watching that video and looking it up, you also, I suggest, you go on there and type another video, Nick Shell, Will I Go Ball Test? Because that's going to give you an overall idea of ways to predict whether you are going to go bald by age 35. That's the real question I ask. Will I be balding by age 35? Because that's really what determines it, which 
is also part of the video. That's the whole premise of a lot of my teachings and my theories. So there you go. That's what I would say to do. I think you're overthinking it, and I think this video about me getting a perm in 1998 is gonna make you feel a lot better about yourself. But still, your other homework assignment is to look up the Will I Go Bald Test video also on YouTube. Type that in along with Nick Shell. Comments right here.